नमस्कार फ्रेंड्स आई पूनम डोगरा वेलकम यू ऑल एंड होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग ग्रेट इन टूडेज वीडियो वी विल लर्न अबाउट वट इज दैल्यू ऑफ लक्स इन डिफरेंट प्लेसेस एंड हाउ दिस लक्स इज बीन मेनटेन एंड टू मेनटेन दिस लक्स वट इज द नंबर ऑफ लाइटिंग्स वी यूज एंड वी विल ऑल्सो सी दैट अकॉर्डिंग टू बी आई एस ब्यूरो ऑफ इंडियन स्टैंडर्ड्स थ्री सिक्स फोर सिक्स पार्ट टू what is the value of lux which is being maintained in different places different places like in hospital in hotel in library etc and uh, if you don't know what is lux what is new mean and uh, what are different terms related to uh, lighting system then i'll recommend you to see my previous video because in that video we have covered uh, different terms related to lighting system we have covered all the terms like luminous flux illuminance candela and uh, uh, lumen per watt etc is being covered in that video so you can check this link here uh, to watch that video because that video will help you to understand this video better and uh, दोस्तों ये वीडियो हिंदी में भी अवेलेबल है तो अगर आप लोगों को लगता है कि मैं हिंदी में ज़्यादा अच्छे से समझा पा रही हूँ तो आप इस लिंक पे क्लिक कर सकते हैं इस वीडियो को हिंदी में देखने के लिए सो फ्रेंड्स लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो एंड दिस वीडियो इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज वी विल सी द कैलकुलेशन ऑफ कैलकुलेशन ऑफ नंबर ऑफ फिटिंग्स एंड वी विल सी वट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ डिफरेंट प्रोडक्ट्स इज बींग मेनटेन इन डिफरेंट प्लेसेज and we will also see a uh, additional bonus in this video so let's see this video so friends let's have a quick look on how much lux is being maintained at different places and this lux value is according to bis 3646 part 2 and according to this office areas like workstation have a lux value of 300 to 500 because workstations or work area requires more lux in comparison to other areas right so uh, public areas like where we have our lunch where, where we have our meetings public areas have a lux value of 100 to 150 corridors or lift area will have a lux value of 70 to 100 friends here one thing to note that uh, mostly the corridor areas or of offices or it can be of hospitals hotels anything will mostly have a lux value of 70 to 100 because these areas are general areas which does not require very much uh, light so uh, it is advisable to use 70 to 100 lux now talking about hotels in hotels entrance hall have a lux value of 100 to 150 reception area where there is a counter and some computer work is being done so in reception area the lux value is higher it's 200 to 300 lux in bedrooms we generally don't require much lighting so in bedrooms the lux level is 50 200 lux now talking about hospitals in hospitals general area have a lux value of 100 to 150 operation theaters which require higher lighting more complex work so in operation theaters the lux level is 300 to 500 lux and in laboratories again their um, work is more intense so there also lux level is around 200 to 300 lux now talking about libraries reading areas have a lux value of 300 to 500 book shelves have a lux value of 70 to 150 and in educational sector like colleges and uh, schools the general area have a lighting of 150 to 300 and other areas like art lab seminars study area have a lux value of 300 to 500 because it require more focus so the lux level is higher now talking about home in homes kitchen area have a lux value of 200 to 300 and bathrooms 
have a lux value of 100 to 150 reading area requires more lux value so it's 150 to 300 lux so these were just some of the lux value which are being maintained in different places of different buildings according to BIS 3646 uh, for details you can download this BIS 3646 part 2 complete PDF in which every uh, single information is there about every place of a building now coming to the important part of the topic which is number of fitting calculation and we will see the formula for number of fittings friends although many softwares like Dilex is in market which will help you to give the number of fittings for a particular area but still I always prefer we should know the basics so coming to the formula the formula is n number of fittings equals to e which is lux level required in that area into area of the room uh, which is equal to length into width divided by f f is total flux in one fitting like we are using a 10 watt bulb and its total lumen is 1000 so it is uh, total flux into uf uf is utilization factor and this we get from the table given in the brochure of the fitting into LLF which is light loss factor these are the losses due to depreciation over time of lamp and uh, due to dirt accumulation on the fitting and uh, walls of the building etc now friends let us understand this formula better by using an example so we have an area of 5 into 5 that is 25 square meter note that uh, the area will be in square meter so we have an area of 25 square meter in which we have to maintain the lux level of 200 so e equals to 200 area equals to 25 and we are given to use a 10 watt bulb with a total lumen of 1000 and its utilization factor is 0 0.6 and light loss factor for an air conditioned office is 0 0.8 okay finally we will calculate the total number of fittings in that area so putting all these values in the formula n equals to 200 which is uh, lux into area 25 divided by total lumen 1000 into 0.6 utilization factor into 0.8 which is LLF so by solving this we will get total number of fittings equals to 10.4 so the number is 10 we will use 10 number of bulbs in this area with 10 watt and 100 lumen okay friends I hope this video have helped you to know uh, how lux is being uh, decided and how number of fittings is being calculated in a certain area so how you find this video comment below and also comment that uh, if you have any suggestions any queries or uh, uh, reviews regarding this video so friends if you like my video please comment and do subscribe to my channel and uh, share with your friends so finally friends, it's time to say bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you for watching.